This is Scott Ryan, and today I'll be reviewing another burned aluminum wiring connection either I or my electricians found recently. Before that, I invite you to my web seminar that will cover three vital points you need to know so you can sleep at night knowing you fixed this problem in your home correctly, permanently, and affordably. Access this webinar now at AluminumWiringRepair.com. Okay, a quick little story about these two outlets. Uh... This client had these outlets in his home. This one was in his kitchen, this one was in his dining room. And when he finally noticed <laughs> that they were giving him problems, he decided to fix them himself. We checked this one out. Of course, the, uh, the correction he did was incorrect. And uh, although it wasn't burning at the time, we had to replace it because it was an ineffectual uh, pigtailing that he did on it. So we fixed the one that was in his, the, the repair that he did in his kitchen. This one, however, was in his dining room, and you can see it is very obvious that there was problems. And he pulled this one out to fix it as well. As a matter of fact, he said that uh, this one had actually started burning his curtains that were hanging over it before he decided to attempt to fix it himself. So he went ahead and said, okay, you guys go ahead and do the job. Let's get this thing fixed up. Well, great. So now we know that we can go in there and keep this uh these events from happening as home again but he called us up the day after and said don't worry about it guys my son said he's gonna take care of us now this is a very typical thing that happens in this business where for some reason for some reason people seem to think that they can fix these themselves well you have to bear in mind that these were installed by an electrician under the supervision under the supervision of a master electrician albeit 35, 40 years ago, but they weren't installed correctly. And so this is the result of an electrician installing these things. Okay? So now what people are doing is they go on the internet and they find out, well, you know what, I think I can do this. And they go out and try to fix this stuff themselves. Well, it seems to me that if an electrician may be able to screw it up bad enough where this could happen, how is it that they think that they can get it done. I've been in homes where people hired their friends who were electrical engineers and they didn't get it right. Master electricians aren't getting it right. So how is it the people think that they can go out and fix these things themselves? I don't know. It's a very strange thing and in my opinion very dangerous. For more information about this topic visit the links in the description below. Also, if you could please like this video and subscribe to this channel, we would really appreciate it as it helps us get this message out to people who desperately need it. This is Scott Ryan. Thank you so much.